Okay, so what am I describing here? Hell on wheels, the angry mob, the modern day plague. Yes, I'm talking about cyclists. Those smug, self-righteous, self-styled eco-warriors who pedal their way onto the moral high ground in their buttock-hugging shorts, <laughs> believing they're here to save the planet, while us motorists are ignorant oiks who want to destroy it. Cyclists think the law doesn't apply to them. They think a red light means go. They have only a passing acquaintance with the highway code. And they zigzag all over the road, behaving like those bottles on their belt are full of tequila, not water. So what I want to know is why is there one law for the cyclists and a totally different one for motorists? Why do we get done for speeding, for running a red light, for road rage, but they don't? Why do we have to pass a test and pay insurance and they don't. Now, in one London borough, they've been given the green light to race along our pavements, putting the lives of kiddies, the elderly and the disabled in danger. It's got to stop. Yes, you heard me. Stop. So let's just correct you first, Carol. Oh, okay. Let's go just on, correct you yeah, first. So you're saying that mm -hmm. there's one rule for cyclists yeah. and one rule. So, you know, Cyclists also have rules and they have penalties. Mm -hmm. So when they make Very a mistake... Very rarely imposed. OK, so let me define you, because I'm the numbers man. OK. Mm -hmm. So you make a statement that says very rarely imposed. So let me give you some facts, Carol. 53,255 penalties were issued. So... The, it's not it enough. Is, Carol... We're it's going back enough. to alternative, okay. <laughs> alternative facts again. Okay. You can't just believe what you want to believe. Listen to the facts. So it is imposed. They do get penalties. So they get penalties if they do something wrong. Mm -hmm. For the last ten years, you know, so the mayor, just... you know, came out because we have a problem right now. Pollution is a big issue. Look at London right now. We don't want more cars on the road. We want more cyclists okay. on the road. Carol, can I, can I take let you me, on about the no, Let me no, take you on about no, pollution. No, you said about pollution. I have pollution. not okay. finished. Okay, how is it healthy for cyclists when they're behind cars that are emitting carbon, carbon monoxide, that sulphur dioxide, diesel particulates? How is that healthy for the you cyclists? You put more cyclists on the road, take cars off the road. That's no, the whole do, point. But how, is, how is the city going? You know what's happened in London now? Carol, Traffic, Carol, Carol, yeah. Traffic Traffic is Carol you've made a statement. Let me respond. So, well, I don't agree okay, with you, okay, well, you can come back to me. So, what I'm saying is, we want less cars on the road. Well, you and might, by, but, but, by you know. putting by putting cyclists on the road, we've now created cyclist lanes. We've created yes. rules. Which they we've got ever regulations. Used. The next thing you're going to do, Cow, is come out and say we want to tax mothers using pavements to push no, rams down the road. Let's, you know, let's come on. About, let's talk about pavements, Jimmy. Let's talk about pavements. So, so Camden is going to introduce the scheme. You know, do you want a what, tax on walking? Well, well, you just said you want to finish. Let, let me finish. So, so now in Camden, what the police have said is they will only take action for cyclists riding on pavements if people have to leap out of the way. OK, so the people leaping out of the way, the elderly, the disabled, the infirm, the deaf, the blind, mothers with kiddies, people this is what we're talking about. So, so, and don't tell me that a cyclist coming at you at 30 miles an hour on a pavement can't do damage. Right. They're like just, speeding bullets, yeah. these like Let's just go things. back. What, you've obviously got a fundamental problem with cyclists. Well, because they have a fundamental problem with me. They think so, I should so, be on so the So basically, road. You're, you're saying, you're, you're sort of... <laughs> You, what you're saying is, um, it's how I feel as a cyclist mm -hmm. that there's this hate-hate relationship between yes. cyclists and cars. It shouldn't be that way. People should feel that cyclists have every right to be on the roads as a car does, OK? Yeah. As they and should abide, be motorists as a, And abide by the same rules, OK? So I cycle a lot. You, it is difficult enough with the quality of our roads even just to keep alongside the curb these days, let alone when you've got... Bus lanes that where buses have run people over. You've got you feel so vulnerable as a cyclist. But you've got cycle lanes Cy all over the country cyclist, now. Cyclists, no, but, but you get you get people. Look, I'll give you. Being spent on it in so cyclists are allowed in bus lanes, which effectively is a, becomes a cycle lane. Let me show you an example of what happens when people okay. aren't watching where they're going. Yes, right. and that's horrendous. That right, was so I could say, I could say, yeah, right. but, but yes. I could say, if you're going to be critical of the cyclist, maybe he was going a bit too fast. OK, now okay. I, I want to show so... you something else. Let me show you something, then. OK, <laughs> oh let me show you God, something what on is the other this? side. <laughs> 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 have, have, watch, have a watch at this. There's a cyclist going through a red light, good lad, right past a policeman. 
And he's doing that, you know, for one very good reason, because he knows he's not going to get done. He's been talked to. I'll, I'll bet, I'll bet and whatever he was you like, he will never get prosecuted. And he was one of the 53,000 people who got that ticket. Let me tell you, I live near Richmond Park. The park is ruined now because, have you heard of something called Strava? Cars? No, have you, no. <laughs> have you heard of something called Strava? This no, is the new is app, the new cult app that cyclists... Did you say Prada? <laughs> Strava. Strava. Yeah, Strava. Yeah. And it's the well, new cult sure. app and all the cyclists use. This is a, yeah. this is a website. What so is it? So when you, you, when you do your regular journeys to and from work, you put down where you're going and how long it takes you. So everyday cyclists aren't just racing against themselves. Yeah. Oh. Other people go on who are doing the same route. So they're all racing. So in Richmond Park now, cyclists are travelling at 40 miles an hour yeah. when the limit is 20. Yeah. And, and it's dangerous. And, they, I agree. and, and, and they'll get they fined. Get well, but they won't, James, because you know why? Oh, 53,000 okay. did. Let me tell you, when two of them did get fined, last year, what they did was all the cycling magazines and the cycling clubs came together and said, oh, hang on, why do Parks Police have the authority to give tickets? And they also tried to say that a bike wasn't the vehicle. So speeding fines so, didn't apply to them. Look, just, so just, they quickly, argue the just quickly, I know you both need to get in, but just quickly, so you're proposing, what, some sort of tax or yes. some sort of insurance? Yes. Yeah. Well, you're saying, hang on, before you even, you don't need to go into the detail, well, because okay, ultimately right. if you're saying cyclists aren't being policed properly anyway. What's the, what, how are you going to police it if you start making them pay tax and insurance? Because you won't be able well, to police it. I'll tell you it. how, one, you've got to have something on a bike that identifies them, because if they yeah. do something That's wrong now, idea. and there's not a no, couple it doesn't around, work. They did it in they Switzerland. They did it in Switzerland for years. Everybody had to have a vignette, a bicycle vignette, on their bike, mm. OK, and they had to stop it. One of the most organised countries in the world. Right. They, they had they to, to stop it, it because you couldn't police it. It's impossible. So what? that means they get away with it. So, so we're talking about the prosecution. It's got what? nothing to do we're getting away with it. It's every that you day can't we're all on the road. And we see people. We see them going through red right. lights. We see them breaking the rules. I heard one Police cyclist the other day Police saying, "I don't like the cycle lanes because it's all just paint slapped on and they're not designed very well." Do you do well. cycle? Hello. Uh, not no, not really. I'm with Carol. I'm with Carol. I, don't see how I, I, I think you can't no. be one rule for us as motorists and another rule for cyclists. Well, the rules do apply, as James rightly said. Just to yeah. a, a point but of clarification, the, the fifty-three thousand figure we quote is from the Metropolitan Police uh, in London and without staying too London centric because as you rightly say I was in Birmingham this week there are cycle lanes there there are cycle mm. lanes all over the country but the problem a brief history lesson the problem was Carol as I'm sure you're aware it was as many as 16 people were being fatally injured on London streets yeah. a year no mayor no city hall can just watch that happen yeah. and with everything as with so many things in local and central government they've gone too far the other way yeah. it was wholly wrong that motorists sorry that cyclists were being injured at any level yes, let alone at that of level of course actually but the amount of road space they've taken away again ridiculous. without staying too london centric but parliament square and bankman viewers will know what is wholly wrong and yeah. this is where it will bite and i can't say who it is but a very senior member of the emergency services said to me we are not going to be able to get a fire truck an ambulance or a police where's just no way we can get down yeah. there and if something happens lives will be lost because we won't be now that is where we have and the you know, pressure. You know yeah. what the average speed in london here, here. is now it's 7.9 miles an hour that's slower than a horse-drawn yeah. carriage that's why people ride and, bikes no, they can get no, to it's a to it's quicker. because, it's because, it's because <laughs> all the lanes have been taken away on the embankment there used to be four oh, lanes it's to so what, it's got now nothing it's to do to with the, yes, the fact has. that every one person in one car and we're selling cars it's because cars and not getting cars out of nothing to do with that at a slow speed nothing to do with that do you know when co Two That's emissions nonsense. are at their worst. It's when cars and vans are travelling at 20 miles an hour, which, yeah, and, and they're travelling at much less. Do you than think? Do you think cyclists now. cause congestion? That the, yes, they're the main reason for congestion. I, the I, fact I, that I, we've got the millions of cars. I don't think you're going to win this argument, Carol. Yeah. They do. I Lanes think in the wrong place.